years ago, long before Jesus was born, there lived a king who loved God very much. The king's name was David. God had chosen him to be king over God's people. King David lived in the wonderful city of Jerusalem. He wanted it to be a place where all of God's people could come and worship. He knew that singing songs to God and telling God that you love him very much is important. Now, in the land of Israel, there was a very special box called the Ark of the Covenant. This golden box had two beautiful golden angels on top looking down. It was very special because God had commanded the people to make it. It was to remind them that God was with them wherever they go. When people saw the Ark or thought about it, they could always remember how God kept his promises to them. David wanted everyone to worship God, so I went to find the Ark of the Covenant and bring it to Jerusalem. He found it on a farm of a man named Obed-Edom. As long as the Ark had been at Obed-Edom's farm, good things had happened to him. God was showing the people that he was with them even though they couldn't see it. Carry the Ark of the covenant to Jerusalem, it was attached to two very long poles. Special men called priests would pick up the poles and carry the ark. Everyone was excited that God was with their, his people and that the ark of the covenant was coming to Jerusalem. The people began to walk toward Jerusalem. They walked six steps. Can you count with me? One, two, three, four, five, six, and stopped. Then David announced, we must dance, shout, and sing to the king. He was talking about God as the king. God. Today we no longer have an Ark of the Covenant that reminds us that God is with us, but we have something even better. God sent his own son, Jesus. There is something that reminds us that Jesus is with us. It's the cross. The cross is empty because Jesus is alive and here with us. That is why we have a cross at the place where we worship. When we see it, we are reminded that we can dance, shout, and sing to the King. The king we sing about it for is Jesus. All right.